Looking at a significant storm impacting our area, but most of the upcoming weekend looks to be OK. At least it'll be a lot milder. Here's a look at the conditions around the area. East Greenwich is at 32. Narragansett uh, standing at 29 degrees with lots of sunshine. Black Island looking good at 31 and Newport. Easton Speech there, 30 degrees right now. No rain anywhere across southern New England. It's just cold and sunny this morning. And this afternoon, although a little milder than the past couple of days, it's going to still be a little on the chilly side, chillier than normal. Uh, mild weekend ahead. Temperatures in the 50s. We could get up to 60 on Sunday. We are looking at a rain and windstorm, though, as Joe mentioned, uh, Sunday night into Monday morning. So we've got some clouds working in uh, here and there, but for the most part, quite a bit of sunshine. Looking across the country, you're traveling today. There's no major issues anywhere. Maybe some snow up there. In North Dakota and Montana, but this uh, weather system that you see here, the area of low pressure, North Dakota, all the way down into New Mexico, it's going to be strengthening as it works its way on off to the east and drawing a lot of moisture from the Gulf of Mexico. And the end result for us will be some rain and wind uh, for Sunday night, Monday morning, especially hour by hour forecast starting off your Saturday with sunshine. Today's quiet sunshine tomorrow, looking at clouds to arrive uh, Saturday afternoon, but we're staying dry Sunday morning sunshine mixing with clouds, but we'll be clouding up. Rain showers are even possible Sunday afternoon, and as we head into Sunday night, late in the night and Monday, all of this rain will be working its way into our area, perhaps even a couple of thunderstorms as well. Monday morning, maybe during the Monday morning commute uh, early Monday, we could be looking at some winds gusting 50 to 65 miles an hour, and that's mainly south and east of Providence for those stronger gusts 40 to 50 miles an hour gusts possible uh, north and west of Providence. The gusts toward the coastline are strong enough to cause some power outages or moderate risk of power outages early on Monday morning. So keep that in mind. Uh, in addition, we're looking at the possibility for some coastal flooding first thing on Monday morning. Uh, high tide generally between 6 and 8 a.m. across all of southern New England there could be some uh, coastal flooding in response to the winds creating some big waves and it being an astronomically high tide for today about 42 degrees for a high a little bit milder as we take a look at tonight going to be cold lows down to about 32 is your seven day forecast 53 degrees tomorrow afternoon close to 60 on Sunday. Some showers around in the afternoon, much greater chance for the heavy rain, windswept rain late Sunday night and Monday morning, but will dry out Monday afternoon. Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, looking good. WPRI.com, you can go there to get your update throughout the upcoming weekend on that storm for late weekend and Monday.